How can we empower companies and policymakers to preserve our planet? Enable them to design sustainable smart cities? Protect people from natural disasters and organized crime? In recent years, displacement costs of people hit by floods and fires decreased by 80%, and mobile apps now inform allergy sufferers around the world of pollen dispersion. Sounds like sci-fi? It isn't. All of this was made possible by Copernicus, the EU's Earth Observation Program that collects and analyzes tens of terabytes of data every day. Data that is full, open and free of charge for all. The quantity, variety and continuity of data generated by Copernicus makes it a major contributor to the big data market, benefiting businesses, scientists and policymakers. Based on satellite imagery and in-situ sensors, its services make up half of the overall European big data market, a real game-changer for the European startups and SMEs. Today, 300,000 registered users benefit from Copernicus data and services through different online data hubs. By making the vast majority of its data and information freely available online, Copernicus opens doors to innovation. New applications and products can be created and tailored to the evolving needs of citizens around the world, from urban planning and marine protection to disaster risk reduction and green energy management. The economic benefits for the end users are huge and expected to grow by an average annual rate of 15% by 2020. What are they? Social impacts, such as fewer casualties in natural disasters. Environmental impacts, such as reduced oil spill damage on ecosystems. Strategic impacts, such as increased competitiveness of the EU industry. And of course, economic impacts. Between 2008 and 2020, 8.2 billion euros have been invested in the development of the Copernicus programme but the resulting benefits will by far exceed the initial investments. The return on investment is expected to reach 16.2 to 21.3 billion euros by 2020 without even considering non-monetary benefits.